Hey guys, Ruben here, Automental, and many of you have been asking about my screencasting setup, which I have in the studio. So in this video, I'm going to show you the little setup I have behind. And um, well, my setup is basically very simple, uh, but it's great enough for me to do some DAW screencasting tutorials, um, do some podcasts, and also some screen recording. So let me just show you what I have on the desk right there, all right? So this is what I have right here. I'm running on a Lenovo 5, Y510P, a laptop that has uh, been serving me for over nearly two years, almost two years, and it's great, okay? Um, all right, so this is how the setup works like. I have a little uh, microphone here, a condenser microphone, and it's the Audio Technica AT2035, which is okay at this budget range, but I do find that, you know, Audio Technica mics generally sound a bit brighter, and they lack the kind of bass depth in them. So if you're looking for a basic voice kind of recording, you might want to avoid buying Audio Technica range at the budget you no know, range. All right. So it's on a stand. <laughs> Looks something like this. Pretty much very very simple. Not the best setup ever because you might have some you know some bangs and, and vibrations that goes in the mic. That's why we have that spider mount there. Okay. So the microphone goes into the complete Audio Six, which is a an audio interface which I've been using for some time right now and and I love that one okay this one is a great 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 audio interface which I really really like and it goes into the computer so if you're doing simple recordings um, if you're doing simple recordings without a DAW without a digital audio workstation let's say you're doing a podcast or just a, you know a simple screencasting you might not need all these you know audio interface and microphones you might just get something like a um, USB microphone, something like that. All right, this is a Samsung Meteor, if I'm not mistaken. Samsung Meteor, I forgot. All right, and behind, let me just show you. You have the USB and also a you no know, monitoring uh, headphone monitoring input for you to monitor what you are actually speaking to this microphone. And it also has a mute button. So depending on the USB microphone you buy, sometimes it might be simply just to buy a USB microphone and use it as your podcasting device. Right, so in my computer here, I'm using Camtasia Studio. You can see I'm there. And uh, the because I'm recording using a DAW, um, so which means I'm recording audio input from the microphone and the second audio input from the DAW, which is from the system audio, I need to use a software called Voice Meter here um, to actually root the two sound, two sound sources into Camtasia Studio. So I've actually written a tutorial on this. Um, the video link is below, the link to the video is below. So if you're interested to learn how to actually, you know, move the audio from the microphone and also the DAW into Camtasia Studio, go ahead and check out the video, all right? Links is below. And yeah, so that's how I actually set up my screencasting software and I mean my screencasting setup in the studio. Very simple. So I hope that helps. If any questions again, please go ahead and ask me. And um, until next time, bye.